and we all know what this is. This is the Thompson submachine gun made in 1940. The American Thompson was favorite among British soldiers for its reliability, large caliber bullet and high volume of automatic fire. Most were fitted with a box magazine during the war rather than the drum magazine made in famous by prohibition era gangsters in the United States. With this magazine, this was pretty heavy submachine gun. So if you use the box magazine, it was a little bit lighter and you could still reload pretty fast. Believe me, it's a heavy submachine gun, caliber 45 ACP. Look at this. Fluted barrel so that cools much faster and then it's a little bit lighter. Hey everybody, just a quick note. Firearms Guide is the world's largest searchable guns and ammo technical reference guide and gun values guide that presents over 80,000 antique and modern firearms, air guns, and ammo with tech specs, high-res images, features, ballistics, prices, and gun values from 100% to 30%. It has the largest professional gunsmithing library with over 23,000 printable gun manuals, schematics, parts lists, and old catalogs. See why all gunsmiths have already subscribed. So join us at firearmsguide.com. That's firearmsguide.com. Wooden stock with a metal butt plate. Look at the rear sight. You could really adjust it however you want. Bolt of the submachine gun is right there on the top. John Dillinger would know how to use this gun, of course, but he didn't make it till the Second World War to prove it in the battlefield. He was gunned down somewhere else. And this is famous Thompson submachine gun used almost everywhere all the way to the Second World War and then of course much much later as well in many different armies in many different conflicts kinda it's a proven design a little bit obsolete today but you know standard pistol 45 caliber round that's also used in 1911 pistol made this pistol to be made this submachine gun to be easily loaded with a standard ammo that could be used simultaneously in a submachine gun or in a sidearm 1911 pistol so great gun even made today in semi-automatic version for civilian use